guys welcome to tuesday i figured i'd pick up the camera and vlog this is my second day off in my vacation week i'm super excited <laughs> you know you just need time off yesterday i didn't really do much yesterday was tuesday wait so is today wednesday today's wednesday <laughs> Okay, so welcome to Wednesday. Yesterday, I didn't do much. I just kind of putzed around here. So today, I actually wanted to get some stuff done. I went to Trader Joe's this morning, which was super fun. I did a workout, which was great. So now I'm going to show you what the heck and hole I got at Trader Joe's. All right, so let me just set you up right here. So I didn't go as crazy as last time, but I did pick up a lot of good stuff. So I got these white cheddar corn puffs. These are so good, I've had these before. Nice little snacky. Two of these maple and sea salt kettle corn because I'm gonna bring one this weekend. Multigrain crackers. Peanut butter protein granola. Never tried this, but I love anything peanut butter related. Petite pumpkin spice cookies. Tortilla chips. Chili and lime flavored. These also looked really good. Dog's treats for the girls. Pumpkin spice pretzel slims. These looked fantastic. Just needed more lemon pepper. I put lemon pepper on everything. I need to pick up some more olive oil. Oh, I wanted to try this. So I love beer. I try not to drink it as much because it's so carby and beer-like, but they had this cookie butter beer and it says that it's made with whole vanilla, milk, sugar, and toasted coconut. I really wanted to try that. <laughs> cold brew coffee, I actually enjoyed this. It's not as strong as the chameleon cold brew. I love the chameleon cold brew coffee, but it's a nice alternative. More lemons for lemon water. Harvest soup, so good. I really, really enjoyed it. I also mixed red pepper flakes in there and it was delicious. And then I picked up this garden vegetable soup. Got some of the Southwest style sweet potato saute bowl. This looked really good. It has sweet potato, jalapeno peppers, black beans, onions, raspberries, pomegranate seeds, blackberries. Picked up this arugula pizza. This lemon arugula basil salad kit. This sounded so yummy. I love anything arugula related. So I'm probably gonna really enjoy that. Non-dairy oat beverage in the flavor maple. I wanted it for in my coffee. These zucchinis. Got two of these butternut squash macaroni and cheeses. These were so good. So I wanted to pick up more. Got gnocchi a la sorrentino. And then three of these spaghetti squash spirals with cheese and sauce. Such like a nice alternative to spaghetti. And that is everything I picked up. Reorganized the fridge. I live for an organized fridge. Now I have to sweep the floors. You know, adult stuff. These girls always make a mess with their toys. Excuse me? <laughs> you see that volume? Whew. Let's do this side. Love this. Okay, so that's gonna go in there. I also really enjoy this Big Sexy Hair Powder Play. This was one of my favorites before I got the Living Proof one. But then when I started using Living Proof, I liked that it gave a little bit of a scent because this is just powder. When I want a little bit more of a zhuzhy kind of scent, I'll go with that one, and it smells bomb skis. But this is just a regular powder. You just sprinkle it into your roots and then massage it. So I have to show you these because I think that they're so darn adorable. My friend Anna actually got these for me. Glass set that has the Golden Girls on it. So this one says, picture it, Sicily 1922. <laughs> oh, this one says, back in St. Olaf, and there's Rose. This one says, Shady Pines, Ma. My beauty has always been a curse. How cute are these? They're like adorable little wine glasses. Also, I did some light decorating for fall. Kind of just switched up what I had on top of here. It's a white and gold pumpkin. Then I just added these two books facing the opposite direction because I just thought that that was such a cute little trend. And then the Rose Forever, which I talked about these on my Instagram and in a previous video. I've had these for over like three months already and they still look perfect. This is such a good gift idea to give to someone. They last for so long. So I'll have a link in the description box. And then I just have my little picture of me and my other doggy, the one that's on my wrist. I put this pumpkin in here as well. My mom gave me this. 
with two coffee table books and inside the pumpkin I put those little string lights so at night it glows up it's so cute <laughs> so let's step into my bathroom <laughs> I want to talk about the Truly products that were sent over. First, I want to talk about the Unicorn CBD Whipped Body Butter. It looks like cotton candy in a jar. So this is what it looks like in the inside. I have used quite a bit. I will say the littlest bit goes such a long way with this stuff. This has CBD, matcha, cannabis, acai, and collagen. So it is vegan. I always try to look for products that are cruelty free because I think it's super important. I have seen a huge difference when it comes to my arms because I used to have red bumps and I've noticed such a big difference after using this for only two weeks so far. My skin just seems way more clear. I usually lather this up at night when I get out of the shower. If you are gonna use this during the day, I would recommend using a light amount. If you use too much, it can have a greasy kind of texture to it. That's why I like to do it at night. I definitely would repurchase it just because I love how hydrating it is in the skin and I love that it's decreased the inflammation in my arms. My next favorite product has to be this Jelly Booster Body Potion. I think that it's so funny that Truly reached out to me when they did because I've been looking for a body serum. I just think that skincare in general, whether it's for your face, for your body, is super important. I wanted to get something that was really beneficial. This helps with acne breakouts and ingrown hairs. So I feel like this is such a dynamic duo. If you are having issues with inflammation or acne on the skin using those two together has just transformed my body skin honestly i'm shocked it just has so many good ingredients in it and i love it it comes with a dropper which is one of my favorite things that a product could have just because it's super easy for application these have to be hands down my two favorite products going into my skincare cabinet if you're new here this looks like a lot, but I am such a skincare junkie. I love trying different things. The next thing I wanna talk about is this Unicorn Fruit Lip Plumping Balm. I was interested in trying this one just to see how it compares to others. And I will say it's not my absolute favorite just because of the consistency. It feels as if it's kind of like coconut oil. It has the same consistency as that. It is really hydrating. I feel like I'm gonna get a lot of use out of this during the winter time. It does have a little bit of a silk consistency once you apply it to your lips. I like that it has a little bit of a mint sensation. It gives like a little bit of a plumping factor. It definitely is hydrating. This Mary Jane Serum. It's so freaking hydrating on the skin. If you guys are new to my channel, I have dry textured skin. So I always look for things that are hydrating and that help with texture. It has the consistency of water almost. I like that it feels thin while it's also providing a punch of hydration. I need all of the hydrating factors I can get. It gives you a nice glow to the face. Serums are so important to implement into your skincare routine because they have a lot of good ingredients. This has glycolic acid in it, so it lightly exfoliates to help resurface the skin. And then the CBD oil helps hydrate and lock in the moisture. So if you have dry skin like I do, I definitely recommend trying this. Now we're stepping into the shower. <laughs> this is the Buns of Glory. I've used so much of this product so far. I swear all this stuff just looks like candy. This is called the Butt Polish. Now I will say that there's not a lot of sugar or polish factor to this, which I'm fine with, but what I really like about this product is that it gives such a hydration to the skin. I've noticed that my tush is a lot more smoother. This is so funny talking about this. <laughs> but I have noticed a difference. I also use this on my stomach, my arms. What's nice about this is that it tightens, firms, so it's more of like an anti-aging factor. It's just so fun to use in the shower. It looks like yogurt. <laughs> Moving over to the last product. This is the Acai Your Boobies. <laughs> I've used a decent amount of this as well. Look at this. 
It's just so cool looking. I love it so much. This also tightens and firms the skin. So it's good for anti-aging. Again, I just enjoy that it makes my skin feel super smooth. It has vitamin A and retinol to strengthen and firm the skin. I've never seen my body skin look as good as it does until I started using the Truly products. It's just, it's crazy. I thought that all of this stuff was gonna be kind of like a gimmick, but it honestly has transformed my skin. But those are my thoughts on the Truly products. I really am impressed by that brand. This is the first time that I've ever used like CBD products and I can't believe how smooth and even it has made my skin. I never thought to even use like CBD products because I just thought it was like a trend that people were just obsessed with at the time. But then when they sent me over those products, I was like blown away. I'm gonna continue to use them. I really wanna try more of their products. They were so kind to give a 10% discount code to you guys in case you guys want to try any of their products. I will leave the code in the description box down below and everything will be linked in the description box. This is my little setup whenever I have to do work. It's kind of ridiculous, but this is all I'm working with right now. Sometimes I sit at my vanity. I wanna get a desk. I don't know where the heck I would actually put it. I have to do some emails, so uh, I'm just gonna be here. have to do a little video clip for one of my subscribers she's so so sweet and she's I believe doing like kind of a music video for one of her newer songs she has such a good voice you guys she's sent me some of her stuff before to listen to and it is just so good I will leave her Instagram in the description box down below so you can listen to the songs that she has on there because her voice is just top notch. I'm so excited for her and I hope that she's able to take this super far. I always like to help out as much as I can for you guys because you guys have helped me out so so much. Probably gonna get a little bit ready so that I can look somewhat presentable. So I just finished doing that little video clip. I think I'm probably gonna end the video here. I have to take the girls for a walk and then I'm probably gonna make some soup for dinner actually let's do a tasting that cookie beer chachioli <laughs> cookie butter beer are you kidding okay is this like a twist off or do i need i think i need do you even have an opener hell done <laughs> That's so good. Mm. Oh, I really like that. Just by smelling it, it just smells like cookies. Mm -mm -mm. I like that. If you're a beer lover, you would like this. That completes this video. If you haven't subscribed, please make sure that you do before you leave. It would mean everything to me and more. And don't forget to follow me on my social medias. Until next time, I will talk to you guys later.